In a young and restless preview for the week of November 27 to 31, is this the end for the Newmans? Read on for the details and watch the video below. Last week, Nikki woke up at the lake house to discover Claire had drugged her and hooked her up to an IV drip of vodka. Claire reconnected with her aunt Jordan, played by Colleen Zank, and they put the next part of their devious plan into motion. Nikki struggled to drink water and sober up, only to succumb and chug vodka out of a bottle. However, she soon regained control and smashed it. Meanwhile, Claire went back to Geno City and claimed to Victor, Nick, and Victoria that Nikki's MS flared up and she was at a hospital near the lake house, but she didn't know the name, luring them into her and her aunt's trap. They weren't the only ones as at the lake house, Victoria's ex Cole Howard arrived. He called out, Nikki, it's Cole. I got your text about Victoria. Is she all right? Coming up in bed, Nikki cries, you did this to me. Jordan tells her, no, Nikki Newman, you did this to yourself. Also next week, Claire brings Nick, Victoria, and Victor to the lake house, and Victor tells Jordan that he's through playing games with her. Jordan responds, this is no game, this is as serious as a heart attack, which you will all be experiencing very soon thanks to the poison you just drank in your water bottles. You don't have long to live, and it's going to be my utmost pleasure to stand here and watch you die. Is Jordan bluffing? Or have the Newmans actually been poisoned? And could Claire actually be Victoria and Cole's daughter Eve? 